hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and on today's video i'm going to be showing you how i did this hairstyle that i have on here which is an african threading updo i did like the entire head let me show you the back so i did all my hair including the back so this is one of the hairstyles that i like to do on my daughter so i thought i should try it on my hair and if you want to see how i did it then keep on watching so i'm going to start by creating like a little circle right here on top where all the lines are gonna end So I'm going to be using like a lot of these kinds of um, clips to part my hair because my hair is short and I want like a semi clean part. So I'm going to be using a lot of these things to part my hair. So I'm going to start right here in the middle. I've already parted it. So I'm going to do six lines in the front and then four lines at the back. So everything's going to come to the top here. And I'm going to go in with my gel wax and this one is by Perfect Touch. You can use an edge control. It's like an edge control texture if you have an edge control. So this is going to make my part look cleaner. So for this hairstyle, I'm going to use wool, which looks like this. It's like the cheapest thing ever. This is like five friend. So I'm just gonna get enough these. Okay. like so so I'm going to go ahead and start doing this one here I already have like a fully detailed uh, video on African threading which I will link somewhere up here and I'll also link it in the description box below if you want to check it out so now I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, do my hair So I'm done with this line. I'm going to do this one here and then come back here and then do this one, do this one, do this one until I'm done.
so i went ahead and put the bag in the bathroom that's how i packed my bag because in the bathroom i have a bigger mirror and i can take this small mirror that i use here and do the double mirror thing so let me show you the bag so this is how the bag is looking i'm going to have three lines so i'm going to have one here one here and one in the middle so i'm going to start with one of these two and then i'll finish with this one here
So I'm just pulling everything up, making sure I have all the pieces from every line. And I'm taking my little elastic rubber band here and I'm going to secure everything like so. So today I'm going to clip on this puff and maybe tomorrow I will switch it up and use some weave like this, some Kelly weave. So you can just do whatever you want with this hairstyle. So today I'm going to put on my puff because this is like my favorite hair piece. It has like two combs, one on top here and one right here on the bottom. So there's two combs here and also a drawstring. So first I'm going to clip on the first comb and then the second comb and then I will pull together the drawstring. So I'm just going to go ahead and clip it like somewhere here. And then secure the back comb. And now I am pulling the drawstrings to make sure everything is secured and make sure this Thing is tight and with these access strings I'm just gonna wrap them around like so and then tie them at the back like do like a double knot and then just tuck it in like so and that's my hairstyle completed so I went ahead and put on some makeup, laid down some of my edges, and yeah, so this is the final look. Let me show you the back. So this is how the back looks. So this is how it looks with the puff attached to it, and I really, really love it. So like I said, you can change up your attachment, like your hairpiece, you can use a weave, you can use like braiding hair to make a bun, like whatever you want can work with this hairstyle. Like I really, really love this hairstyle. Like I said, this is one of the hairstyles that I do on my daughter like every two weeks and it actually works well with her hair. So it's super perfect for kids. And to do this hairstyle, it took me about an hour to finish because I also did the bag, but I'm, if I'm doing it on someone else, like my daughter, it takes me like 30 to 40 minutes. So it doesn't take that long. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and don't forget to enable the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye.